Hey you guys, all right, so let's go over real quick what we're going to be doing this week as far as core strength is concerned. So we're gonna be building every day. So I don't want you to think this is all gonna be on one day. So what I want you to do is check the post every day and then we're going to be adding one thing to our uh, movement or our strength building. So we're starting with the plank. We started with the plank yesterday. Your plank is either on your knees Dieter, you can't see me right there. On your knees or pushing through the heels on your feet. All right, I'm gonna be pretty specific here. I want you to open the feet a little wider, draw the navel in. Now notice, I have a slight pike, right? I'm not down here. That's because I'm drawing the tailbone under to engage the core even more, gazes straight down. Arms are not locked out, they're slightly bent. And we stay here for 30 seconds. Then the next day we add an elbow plank. Elbows are underneath the shoulders. Knees can be down, 30 seconds. Woo, take your rest. Then we're coming to the belly. All right, so from the belly, the hands are gonna be behind you, palms up, and we're going to lift up. Try to relax the glutes a little bit and lower. That's gonna be for a count of 10. Now this is gonna be the third day, all right? Now notice I'm lengthening through the spine as I'm lifting up. Notice the difference between this and this, crunching the back. We're not gonna crunch, guys. We're just gonna lift gently and release. Excellent. Then take a rest into child's pose. Oh, that felt good. This feels good. Right, Dita? Right, Dita? And then Fourth day, you guys, we are going to come into boat pose. Boat pose can be toes or heels on the ground. We're kind of in the place between the tailbone and the sit bones, but our spine is long. Hands can be out here in front or underneath the knees, and we're gonna stay for a count of five. You can also straighten the legs or just keep it right here. Then on the fifth day, guys, you're just turning right back around and you're going back into your high plank, into your low plank, 30 seconds, and then your core work is done back into child's pose if you want. That's it, all right? So just building each day and I will cue you on what we're building on. Have fun with this. Be sure to breathe. And just remember, it's just a few moments out of your day. You just have to train yourself, discipline yourself enough to slow down and just do it. It's not terribly hard. <laughs> All right, have a great one. I'll see you. Bye.